Welcome to another video tutorial. In this video, I will show you that how we can create gene ontology and get enrichment plot using our SR plot website. So let me take you to the computer screen and see. Here you can see this is our keg and gene ontology combined dot plot. Here on the x-axis you can see we have negative log of p values and on the y-axis we have number of p gene counts and we have up and down regulation. So let me show you that how you can prepare your data and how you can access to this website to draw your simple go and get plot using this website. So first of all, you can simply go to bioinformatics.com.cn slash English version. So you on this panel from here, you can see we have transcriptome analysis. We can simply click on this and we can go to page number two. And here you can see we have combined go and keg part dot plot. So you can simply click on this. So it will take you to a new window. From here, you can input your data to draw your plot. So here is the one example. In this, we have actually the five column. In the first one, you can see we have actually the go terms. You can write go terms, whether it is related to biological processes, cellular components, or molecular function. And you can also use directly the CAD pathway categories as well. So here is the number count of genes, and here is the P value, and here is the regulation. So you can also prepare your data in the form of these graphs so you you can also prepare your data in the form of these groups after you have prepared your data so you can simply copy all this data and take back to this sr plot website and paste your whole data in this input data box and from here you can adjust the figure weight and from here you can adjust the figure height and uh, from here you can adjust the font size and similarly you can adjust the color for up and down and here in this example you can see we are using the red color for up if you want to change you can simply slide over and change this color but i will go with the default colors from here you can adjust the bar width and from here dot minimum size and dot maximum size and here what you want to write on the x-axis and here the negative log 10 will be automatically added and whatever in this X axis you want to write, you can simply write it here. Like in this, we can write simply p value and how you want to order your p values. So after that, you can select the font family and you can simply click on the submit button. But make sure that you should must log in before using the submit button. As I have previously mentioned in my videos, this website is totally free to register and you can register and use this website for freely. But if you haven't registered so far and you don't want to register, you can simply log in using this test account and this test password. So now we have pasted our data. We can simply click on this submit button. Draw our go and check dot plot. In this example, you can see we can download the result in the form of PDF, PNG, and SVG. So let me download it for you in the form of PDF. So here you can see our PDF is ready to download. You can see our go keg dot plot is ready and we can directly use in the research article. So hopefully this video will be helpful in analyzing your transcriptome data. But if you have still any, please let me know in the comments section. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.